so morning everybody RB's out under the RB bridge and we're riding this again look it's a Colt 50 my little bit of fun to be had this morning now side stand only make sure the side stands up when you start the bike it will not start with the side stand down you have to sit on the bike to start it's so quiet it's lovely now we have test ridden one of these already for WK I was screaming like a child now it's not the fastest to get up to 30 mile an hour but once you're in fourth gear you can just hit fourth gear all the time and put it around like a lunatic so as I say most 50s take ages to get to 30 mile an hour but so much fun to be had on one of these we shall let the car go even though I can probably filter through that gap and a little shake of the hand from the driver saying thank you you're welcome now Colt 50 get the revs up it's a 50cc you're not going to uh, wreck the engine by giving it loads of revs fourth gear once you're in fourth gear though you can hammer around like a loon it takes the bumps in its stride it's great i love this oh 50cc fun But you can literally stay in fourth gear, puddle through the corners in fourth gear. You don't need to change down. Just use the fourth gear to open it up and slow back down again. Now you've got to remember it's 50cc. Most scooters are going to do around about 25 to 30 mile an hour. You're not going to get bang on 30 every time. And everyone's like, oh yes, but my scooter does 32. Well, you're doing two mile an hour more than... Uh, it recommends but good luck to you if you can get 32 out of one of these happy days but the best thing is it is designed for 16 year olds as a first bike as a training tool to get used to riding bikes and having a little bit of fun and I'm quite happy third gear let's just open up a bit I say it's not the fastest bike in the world it's the fun factor, this is amazing. I'm loving this. 30, look, your speed, 22, thank you. <laughs> Remind me. But once obviously you've worn the engine in a little bit, it will get a little bit faster. Once it's all loosened up, it will get to be a little bit quicker. Now I did the first review on this, screaming like a child, laughing like a loon, and obviously you've just got to watch yourself when you pull out onto dual carriageways at 30 mile an hour. But around town, just nipping about, this is great fun. Now when we first got these, clutch is a little bit harsh when you're going through the box, but it does loosen up. <laughs> it loves hill climbing as well. Now compare this to the uh, twist and go scooties. They are a bit of a pain in the bum now. We actually did the hill climb on a twist and go ped, not from WK. And on the big hill climb, if you've seen me do the hill climbs, we actually had the bike down to 21 mile an hour. And I'm like, come on, come on, come on. But uh, a geared bike is always going to get there a little bit quicker with a twist and go because you can just get a bit more revs on it but obviously once run in great fun and the customer has bought this one has opted for the white one they do these in red and black or they do them in white but considering that I am just over 12 and a half stone I'm heading 13 again I've been piling the weight on too many workouts down the gym most of your young riders, 16, 17, are going to be around about sort of 10, 12 stone mark, unless you're a hulking great brute of a, a 16 year old. But I'm 5'10, 32 inside leg, my legs tuck nicely under the tank. I'm still giggly like a child. I love it, I love it, it's really good. It's great fun, just sitting here doing 30 mile an hour around town, and if you're using it to get to school, get to college, or whatever, it's your first bike. 
Yeah, I'm going to go find the only one of these. And the boys at WK, they've all taken the mickey out of me at WK. They were like, Rev's been out on the 50, Rev's been out on the S, I know, but I, I think this is great. First bike, now, you can call us fourth gear. You haven't got to drop down any gears. You can literally stay in fourth gear, pod around, twist and go, as they say. Controls are very basic, horn, indicators, main beam, dip beam, pass lights. You've got a headlamp flash, hazard lights and a start button on the other side. Mirrors are nice and wide. Nice easy to display to see what you're doing. So currently doing 27. So it's not going to do a full whacking rate 30 straight out the box. But it will obviously get a little bit looser. I'm just watching my mirrors, making sure that the cars are out the way. That's a 40 mile an hour road down here anyway, so I'm only doing 10 miles less than the norm. And we are going to do the industrial estate and some back roads. So, fourth gear through the corner. You can corner these at 30 as well. So literally just go. off again. Great fun to be had at 30 mile an hour. Now they have got uh, the twist and go scooters at WK. I did love the TT Max. Now a friend of mine, and it turns heads as well. I <laughs> see people looking at it like, what's that? Is it a pit bike? No, it's a full registered WK Colt. But it does turn heads, this little thing turns heads, you can see just people looking at you and you go last and like, why is he riding in a full uh, GoPro kit yeah, on a 50? That's just RB doing a test ride. Well, we're going to stay in fourth gear, I'm just going to see what it's like around the corner, fourth gear. Open it up a little bit and away we go again. So just let the revs build up. Well, you can obviously drop it a gear, but stay in fourth, just use the fourth gear. I found it a lot easier. Anyway, back to this TTR 50 twist and go that uh, WK used to have. They've obviously changed it now, it's the GT Max 50. But the TTR 50 was a great little scoop. And a friend of mine, otherwise known as Western Supermoto, who is a big bike vlogger, YouTuber, TikToker, he uh, bought one for his daughter and uh, I said to him, what's it like? And he went, I've never had so much fun on a 50, he's used to flying around on a whacking great big VFR. And he said, I have never had so much fun flying around on that 50, it's great fun isn't it RB? And I went, believe me it is. And he said, uh, I said, oh, what did you think of actually getting out on the bike? He said, believe it or not, he said, I did turn some heads. Uh, there was me, out full uh, Honda levers, full face crash helmet, GoPro, gloves, the whole lot, the tinted visor, packing around on this 50, and I got some really strange looks. He said, but the fun factor that he had was brilliant. So go and check him out, Western Super. Moto, M-O-T-O, -O. his name's Phil, now he bought one of these, uh, bought one of the uh, TTR 50s for his daughter, but go and check out that ride video, he is grinning like a Cheshire cat, like I am, I have never had so much fun on a 50, it is great fun, oodles of fun, but you've obviously just got to keep your eye on the traffic behind, and build your speed up really, really quickly, but around town, 30 mile an hour areas, it's not a problem. So we're four miles in, I'm having oodles of fun here. The only time is obviously having to stop for traffic, which slows you up. Come on, let's go, let's go. Oh, you would have to uh, give way to the cars from the right. Pops and bangs. But 
but 30 miles an hour areas, no problem getting up to speed around town. Obviously longer runs, just keep your eye on the mirrors, watch out for uh, the cages in the cars. But a lot of fun to be had on one of these. And I'm, <laughs> I'm test riding the stuff that WK's in. These are some really good bikes. Now obviously, compared to other brands, and people say, Oh yes, but you're not allowed to mention other brand. I pull no punches on my ride reviews. Yes, the bike is slow to get to 30, but it is a typical 50cc geared bike. Now you consider, and I'm going to name one, the Lexmoto Hunter. It came out, it was out for about a year, and it looked very similar to the old Honda SS50s. Very, very similar. But when it first came out, everyone went, oh, a geared 50. Next motor, I've got a geared 50. It lasted a year, it was discontinued because engines weren't normally all that. They were getting ragged to pieces. The, uh, the build quality was okay, but they had numerous frame faults where it was designed or this was going wrong, that was going wrong. So far, there have been no recalls on this bike because the build quality is superb. And then you can see that obviously you've got your foreign brands, otherwise known as Yamasaki. And believe me, if you go and Google how bad the Yamasaki is, it was awful. Design quality was awful, the build quality was awful. Masses and masses of them had wiring issues where either the loom was burning out or the electrics weren't connected up correctly. But you compare them to this WK Colt, this thing is just pure build quality superbness. It comes in the box for us, we literally all we do is just uh, Basically, add a handlebar, I think, and put a front wheel in. Most of it is all pre-assembled in the factory, but the one thing I do like is it's got QC stickers all over it, and if you know what I'm like in the garage for doing my quality control checks, QC stickers all over it. One person's built it, the second person's come round behind and checked the bike. And believe me, I've done... Numerous QCs on bikes, you do find the odd loose bolt where someone's obviously not paying attention on the production line. But so far, every single WK that I have had in, I've done my QC on it and there is never anything wrong. The only thing I think we had recently was one of our SXs and the customer had been going over and up and down, over and backwards and forwards over potholes all the time, over speed bumps, and he's shaken his reg light loose from the tail tidy. How easy is it getting to there? Probably about 20 minutes, flip out the tail tidy, tighten the bolts, a little bit of Loctite on them, but that was just from basically rattling down country roads over a lot of potholes shaking the bike about. But obviously when we checked it all over it was good. So bolts do shake loose on a bike. Speed bump, look at that. <laughs> Give WK their credit, their QC, and obviously uh, their quality control in the factory is second to none. And that is what you want on a new bike. You don't want to be tinkering around, having to do stuff, and sort this out, sort that out. Getting all your bits and pieces wrong. So, brilliant fun. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant fun. Now we're up to 28. That's good. It's starting to loosen off a little bit. Obviously, brand new engine, it does take a little bit of running in. You know it's going to lose speed on a hill climb. And we'll probably end up doing a probably about 25, 26, no, 26. So we are still within our 30 mile an hour range. 30 mile an hour is the maximum. It's not a target for you to hit. 30 mile an hour is your maximum speed on any of these roads. So this thing, holding its own, people don't need to overtake, because if they did, they were speeding.
the town we go, braking on this is superb, through the corner in fourth gear and just open it up again so you can literally, and I'm just proving the point, stay in fourth gear and just open it up all the time, or even just drop down to third, get a bit of power back up to fourth but you shouldn't need to change gear too much on one of these you can literally rock around town in fourth gear all the time I didn't know where he was going then. No worry about setting speed cameras off with one of these. It's just pure rideability and fun factor. I'm still gridded. But look at it. Okay, but turn the indicator off RB. Go, 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 naughty boy. So we're going to head back to the garage in a second. Go and grab my obligatory cup of coffee. We'll change down to third for this one. Through the corner. And I'm going to go through that. It's yellow. <laughs> Naughty RB. Let's bring the throttle open, see what we can get flat out on the flat. We're doing all right, 27, 28. I think I may need to put a little bit more air in the tyres, because obviously we're set up. Probably add another couple of PSI, will get me another mile or so more. All about more. And do I ever fear we're going down dual carriageways? Absolutely not. As long as you're watching that mirror and you'll stay in, I would say, position one on one of these, don't dominate a lane, stay in position one. Gives plenty of room for the cars to get round you, like he has just done. But we're doing well, we are eight miles in. Great fun, great fun. <laughs> oh you like, come on bike, come on, come on, but it does 30, 28, there we go. You know I am going to get absolutely ribbed by the big motor vloggers, RB was out on the 50 doing 30 mile an hour, yes boys, thank you very much, but I'm having so much fun. I'll tell you what, I would love to get one of our big boys on this, one of our... Uh, Big YouTuber, someone like Peaky Biker or Andy DSA Tractor. <laughs> oh, get one of the big motor vloggers on one of these. Peaks would love this. Peaky would absolutely love going on one of these. Well, you didn't look then. <laughs> we got a right hand indicator on. I got my licensing conflict packet. Yes, you did, sir. <laughs> You can stop really, really quickly on one of these. You're only doing 30, so you haven't got to worry about those cages in cars that just cannot drive. In fourth gear, you can just push this thing around through the corners in fourth gear and have fun. This is what the this is what motorcycling is all about. It's not hacking around like an absolute loon like I do on the GTR. It's about taking your time, enjoying the scenery, the fun factor, and this is just fun, fun, fun. It's great, love it, absolute, I think, how many times have I said I love this bike during this video? It's great. Right, RB's going out to ride a 125 now, go a little bit faster. Well, that's your cold 50. <laughs> oh, I'm such a child, honestly, I am such a child. Right, 
back to the garage we go. If you enjoyed it, give us a thumbs up, click like, share, subscribe, and all of that stuff. Let me know what you think of these. I think it's great. Until the next time, though, be well, ride safe, and from a cheery, smiley RB, it's a big goodbye from me.